Friends, you had studied about motor and generator at your school, but have you know all the motor and generators are working on a same basic principle? Hello friends, myself Vikas and you're watching our channel Easy Way Tech. Guys, today in this video we will discuss about common and very basic principle on which every motor and generator is working. So keep watching till the end. So let's get started. So guys, as we all know that any object can be displaced from its position by the help of any force. Now in case of motor or generator this force will be developed by the property of magnet. We know that the opposite poles of any magnets are attracts and the same poles are repels. So friends this attractive and repulsive property of magnetic poles is used in any motor and generator. Let's take an example of motor. When current is flowing through its stator winding, the stator becomes a magnet and produces a magnetic field. As we know, a rotor is already placed at the center of pole center, so having a closed circuit and free to move. So according to the Faraday's law, the EMF will induced in that conductor also. So this will be have also behave like a magnet and because now there are two magnets the stator and rotors then attractive and repulsive force are applied and hence as a result the rotor will rotate and however in case of generator rotor is not short circuited and connected to the load in this load will be electrical load and whenever we rotate the rotor mechanically then the flask will cut out and according to faraday's law an emf will develop in rotor conductor and hence the current will flow through the load so guys i hope now you will understood the basic principle behind the motor and generator if you find this video is good then please like and share and keep subscribers so that forward